I'm Alex Clifford, a disability gymnast. A disability gymnastics programme has been in place at British Gymnastics since 1985. The sport used to be known as GMPD. And it has now been changed to disability gymnastics. We're going to show you some of the benefits and how you can get involved in this fantastic sport. So now it's over to some other people who are involved in disability gymnastics to find out more. It used to be gymnastics and movement for people with a disability, which nobody ever understood and kept asking, what does GMPD mean? You always have to explain what GMPD means. Uh, when you say disability gymnastics, disability gymnastics speaks for itself. Okay, so what are the aims and ethos of disability gymnastics? Disability gymnastics covers all ages. We are pan-disability, which means we, we take learning disability, physical sensory impairment. It is available to everybody irrespective of their disability. There is no barriers, whether you're in a wheelchair or whether you're fully ambulant. Uh, there's something you can do within gymnastics and trampolining. It's our job as coaches to find that ability and get the best out of them. Disability gymnastics is a sport that can be accessed from a range of different levels. I love being part of this sport. Now let's find out what disability gymnastics is for. It has helped me with my confidence and my balancing, my coordination, um, making new friends, enjoying every moment of it. Well, I first got involved because I couldn't really do anything else because of my arms. And someone just, just goes trampoline in class once a week. It's just fun. I, I love doing it. Achievement is very important for everybody. A person who thinks they can't do anything, they must feel very worried. And you work with them over a period of weeks, over a period of months and then suddenly they achieve something. I always use the scenario of a forward roll. Um, in a mainstream gym club, um, a forward roll is probably the first move they ever learn. In a disability environment, getting them to do a forward roll could take up to six, nine, 12 months. And the sense of achievement when they actually get it is just has to be seen to be believed. And that applies for the parents as well, because they perhaps think that sometimes their child's never going to achieve something like that. And, and it's important that they understand that we can do so much to help them. I started off like really shy and really quiet. And then eventually once I've got used to know people, I became more confident in my own self. After a while I um, got out of my shell and just started enjoying things. At the end it made me feel really proud and happy that I achieved something like that. We need to enable all gymnasts to focus on what they can achieve, not what they can't achieve. So now what opportunities do exist in disability gymnastics? Disabled gymnasts can become involved in all the disciplines offered by British Gymnastics. Disability competition pathways can be found in acrobatics, team gym, men's artistic, women's artistic, trampoline and rhythmic. Displays take place all over the, all over the, the country. A lot of displays available in gym fusion, national gym fusion, regional gym fusions. But there's also the gym for life, gymnastradas. All those are open to gymnasts with a disability. Disability gymnastics is really a discipline that's inclusive for everyone. They can offer a wide range of opportunities for people who can't fit in a mainstream gymnastics environment. To find out more information on disability gymnastics, head to the British Gymnastic website at www.british-gymnastics.org. You can also use British Gymnastics Club Finder on our website to find the nearest disability gymnastics club to you.